Hello everyone. In this video, you will learn the mean value theorem. Mean value theorem. F is differentiable on interval A, B and continuous on A, B including A and B. Then there is at least one number C that you can find in A, B such that f prime c is equal to f b minus f a over b minus a. This is the gradient of the function at c. Rolle's theorem. If f is differentiable on interval a b and continuous on a b including a and b, and if f a is equal to f b and it is equal to 0, it means that at a and at b, the function cross the x axis, then there is at least one number c in interval a b such that f prime c equal to 0 or such that the gradient is equal to 0 at point c. If you remember, this is the extremum point, maximum or minimum. If for all x in a, b, f prime c is equal to 0, it means that f is constant on a, b, a straight line. Example 1. Determine all the numbers c which satisfy the conclusions of the mean value theorem for fx equal to x cubed plus 1 on interval 0, 2. f is continuous on 0, 2 because f is a polynomial. f is differentiable on 0, 2. First, find f 0. So, substitute 0 into x. We have 0 cubed plus 1 equal to 1. And then we find F2. We have 0 and 2. So F2 is 2 cubed plus 1 equal to 8 plus 1 equal to 9. This is FB. This is FA. So FB minus FA over B minus A equal to 9 minus 1 over 2 equal to 8 over 2 equal to 4. Next, find f prime x. f prime x is 3 x, 3 minus 1 is 2, 3 x square plus differentiate a constant, we get 0. So, f prime x is equal to 3 x square. According to the mean value theorem, f prime x is equal to f b minus f a over b minus a. So, 3 x square is equal to 4. If we solve this, we get x equal to plus minus 1.1547. We get plus and minus two values because we have even power. We need to find a value of x in the interval 0, 2. The only x that is in the interval 0, 2 is the positive 1.1547. So, we only have one positive solution. Example 2. Determine all the numbers C which satisfy the conclusions of the Rolle's theorem for fx equal to x cubed minus x on interval 0, 1. f is continuous on 0, 1 because it is a polynomial. f is differentiable on 0, 1. First find f a. a is 0, b is 1. f 0 is 0 cubed minus 0 from this function 
zero minus zero is equal to zero. F one because b is one equal to one cube minus one equal to one minus one equal to zero. Hence, f b minus f a over b minus a is equal to zero minus zero over one equal to zero over one equal to zero. F prime x is equal to 3x square from here minus 1. According to the Rose theorem, f prime x is equal to 0. So, when f prime x is equal to 0, where actually this one is fb minus fa over b minus a, you get 0. That's why this one is 0. So, you have this one, 3x square minus 1, equal to 0. Because f prime x is 0. So from here, plus 1, you get 1. Divide by 3, so divide 3. So you have x square equal to 1 over 3. You have an even power. Hence, you have two answer. One is positive, the other one is negative. Square root of 1 third equal to plus minus 0 0.5774 however you need to find x on the interval 0 1 the only solution that lies on 0 1 is plus 0 0.5774 hence the positive solution plus 0 0.5774 lies between 0 and 1 thank you